Salute people, we back. Fred White, Tales from the Pen. If you're new to the channel, go down and hit the subscribe button. Click the bell notification and then click the word all. Last night I put up a video in case some of y'all missed it. About 11, 12 o'clock last night I put up a video I was at the scene where a sexual assault had happened earlier in the day in broad daylight. Dude stalked, her, stalked this young girl, ran up behind her, tackled her, tried to rip her her pants off, put his hands all down his pants and ran off in broad daylight. It makes me sick. If you haven't seen the video, go watch it. You know what I mean? The dude probably local. By the looks of him, I'm saying, you could go to probably a diner. Probably, you know, he's probably back there washing dishes. Or he works in the bodega behind the deli. One of the two. Scan the areas and you'll find the guy. Again, go check the video I put out last night, you'll see. Also last night, I spoke on about how I approached somebody in the park the other day, made him leave, right? He was, you know, walking, lurking around the kids, acting funny, looking in the garbages, sitting there. I could tell by the way he was staring. I'm watching his face. Here's the video, guys. We got this dude over here in the park. I don't know if he's here with anybody he's thinking about. But, I don't know, he just looks weird, like staring at the kids and shit. Let's just get a, let's just get him on video. He's gonna chase his ass down. Where'd he go, let's see. He's like walking around. I don't know if he's here with anybody, but it just looks weird. You know what I mean? Look, he's just standing there, see him? Just right by the swings over there. Yeah. Look at him. You see him? Look, he's see me follow him. I don't know if he's like here with anybody or I don't, you know what I mean? So I don't, but I, I just, I don't think he is. Look at him. Just like walking around the park. This looks weird to me. God forbid he goes near my son. Anybody, man? You here with anybody? How old are you? Like 24? I'm not, because I see you, you know, the way you're looking at the kids, the way you, you know what I mean? I just want to know you're here with anybody. Oh, no, I found something. Yeah, I think I somebody lost their phone. Where's the phone? So you were just you were just asking the kids if they want their phone? Yeah, I'm just trying to like teach them how to I'm trying to see like who the phone does. Just say hi. Say how you doing. I don't know, you look you look you look like Yeah, because they're looking like looking like you trying to like snatch a kid up or something like that. You know what I mean? I don't I don't like that. You just look funny to me. You look like a fucking pedophile. You in here looking at these kids, talking to these kids, asking these kids questions. Listen, man, I know you don't know me, man. Get the fuck up out of here, man. You know what I mean? It be in your bed. Yeah, just walk away silently. Good job. Because <clears throat> I hate to fuck you up in front of these kids. <laughs> just keep it moving, man. Y'all already know, not around me. It don't happen. Mm -mm. Not here. Yeah, y'all see that? Not here. Mm -mm. Not around fair wife. Nah, it's not gonna happen. Not gonna happen like that. But that's the thing, right? About parents, especially when they're in the park, right? Is that a lot of times these parents come to the park and what do they do? They're on their phones, right? They check in their Instagrams, they check in their Snapchat, their TikTok, TikTok, whatever the fuck. They're not really paying attention to what's going on around them, right? A lot of stuff happens right in front of parents because, you know, they're not aware, they don't believe it can happen. You always gotta be mindful and diligent about your surroundings, period. 
right? But especially when you see somebody who, I don't know, it's just, I'm, I'm not telling anybody can't go to the park, you know what I'm saying? But it's just weird to me with certain people, you can look at their face. You know what I mean? Yeah, I just feel like, you know, you shouldn't be oogling and googling at kids and staring at them with your eyes wide open and you ain't even got no kids in the park. Like, what are you here for? I don't know. I know I'm weird and I'm not telling anybody I can't hang out in the park because, but you guys get the point. And the point is, you gotta be, you gotta be aware of where your kids are at all times. There's been scenarios where people have had their kids missing while they're in the park with them. You know, somebody done came and took them and they can't find them. Where's my kid? Well, if you weren't watching fucking Snapchat 24 hours a day, you know where your kid is. People, we gotta be mindful. We gotta protect the kids. That's most important, number one. You gotta protect the kids.